Sousa Ventures has largely flown under the radar since its founding eight years ago. But as the seed-focused firm prepares to announce its latest batch of funds, mere weeks after seeing a nearly 1,000x return on the first investment the firm ever made, its partners are ready to reflect on the journey to get there. Sousa co-founder and general partner Chad Byers has always been a Silicon Valley kid. The son of Brooke Byers, one of the founding members at Piner Perkins, and the brother of Blake Byers, until recently a longtime general partner at GV, he was no stranger to the venture capital ecosystem. After stints in operating roles at companies like marketing startup Integrate and as an angel investor, the youngest buyers thought there must be a way to combine the two passions. How do you merge operating and building something and investing? The only real answer was to start your own venture fund, buyers tells Forbes. That he did. He launched Sousa Ventures in 2013 alongside Leo Polovitz and Seth Berman with a $25 million debut fund that included capital from more than 70 family offices and high net worth individuals. It was difficult to raise, Byers admits. Now, eight years later, the firm has raised a collective $550 million, seen seven exits from its first fund and has backed a handful of current unicorn companies. The San Francisco-based firm looks to continue this trajectory with a newly raised $375 million across several funds, as originally reported in Midas Touch newsletter. One Sleeve, Sousa Ventures 4, has $125 million for seed stage opportunities, and the other, Sousa Ventures Opportunities 2 has $250 million for follow-on investments. This latest raise will allow Sousa to continue its bread-and-butter strategy of investing $1 million to $2 million into seed stage companies, and $10 million to $15 million at the growth stages. While the firm is technically sector agnostic, 90% of its current portfolio is within fintech software as a service, supply chain and logistics and healthcare, which Byers expects will continue. Byers credits his team and the success of Seuss's first fund for the scale they have achieved today, and he isn't afraid to admit that luck was involved in that fund's performance. The first deal I did in the fund was Robinhood, Byers says, a $250,000 investment in 2013. As a firm we got extremely lucky that the founders of Human Interest, Policy Genius, all those entrepreneurs, took a chance on us as an unknown fund at the seed stage. Despite its early victories, Sousa has been careful not to expand too quickly, Byers adds. The fund raised $50 million for its second fund in 2016, and $90 million for its third three years later, despite knowing that they had interest to raise significantly more. Your fund size is your strategy, Byers says. We are firm believers that your fund size should be an output of the details that matter, 